19 April, 17 and 75, the harbor town of Boston, in the darkness of the night. On orders of the Crown, the Redcoats mustered up in the shadows out of sight and headed on across the bay to seize the stash of rebel arms hidden down the road about 16 miles away. 800 tested warriors, the finest troops alive, on their way to take the cannon in that year of 7-5. In Concord Town, they'd be there with the rising of the sun, westward down the road, past a place called Lexington. Out onto the open green, with muskets at the ready, the British column marched, ranks aligned and steady, and there they saw, lined up in the open, a shabby band of rebels, just simple countrymen. 800 tested warriors, the finest troops alive, on their way to take the cannon in that year of 7-5. We'll wait and watch and pray, and if and they should come, we'll gather here upon the green at the call of Billy Diamond's drum. For eight tough years this war would rage, the foundation of our heritage. And at Yorktown, the surrender, as you know, ended that long war, and our freedom did bestow. It's now another time, another day, and this all seems so far away. But for just a moment, try this now. Think of those men, of what they did, and how. Put yourself there in their place. What would you have done? Do we have the courage still of these men in their homespun? Is it still there in our hearts, the courage and the pride, the love of country, faith and will, all the things for which they died? Out there on that green, in the first rays of the dawn, the men that answered Billy's drum. Then at the old North Bridge, the men that gathered there, the odds they had to overcome. Do we sit now in the comfort of our homes, the apathy of notion, that the threat's no longer real? Are we now of simple mind, that vigil there's no longer need? That freedom's ours without ordeal? Our right to this, the world will concede? Or are there still in power those who take from us by force, who in the name of goodness would seek to set our course? Better they, they think they know, those who think, as did the crown, that simple people have not the right to decide what's theirs. To lead their lives and pray and grow, to live and love and work and choose, and to, if need be, stand and fight. 19 April, 17 and 75. Do we really have it still? Is that spirit still alive? If we heard the call of Billy Diamond's drum, do we have it still within us to stand forth and overcome?